So I want to show you this video from Mommy Tang. She's a long-term vegan and she's showing what she packs for a kid's school lunch. And unfortunately, it seems like she's another mom that somehow adequately provides basically everything for her kids except for a well-rounded lunch for school. So, so far we have rice balls, which is just rice and seasoning basically. Got some cucumbers, a little soy sauce on the side. So not terrible so far. So we have more carbs coming in via this bread. So we're up to carbs on top of carbs. And then you'll never believe what she puts on top. Look at this. More rice, rice crackers and lollipops. And not just two lollipops for her kids, two lollipops for her kids to share. And they live in a huge house, drive a nice car. These kids are adequately provided for in every other aspect. Why is the food so lacking? We have more sugar with Capri Sun and more sugar with cookies. How many calories of protein and fat is that? None. It's non-existent in that meal. Mommy Tang then goes on to show what her and her man have for lunch. And look what it is. Protein and fat. The two components completely MIA from her kids' school lunch. Because she knows that she can't sit down and eat just suckers and juice and rice and feel full and satisfied for six to eight hours, but she does it to her kids. And I'm not saying she does it out of spite or whatever, because if you look at her other videos and her Instagram, her kids are clearly very well taken care of. I just think that she has a lot of misinformation from other, probably from other prominent YouTubers saying that a carb-heavy diet is adequate. And although I will say when it comes to those, all those beans that they're eating, man, that was a huge contributing factor to me basically having no digestion towards the end of me being vegan. They just went right through. But yeah, I could not be sawing into burgers so big that they can't even fit into my mouth, shoving it into my gaping maw while my kids are at school with only a few hundred calories of sugar. I, don't, I just think it's a huge lapse of judgment on her part. But luckily, she has shared custody of her kids with her ex-husband who is not vegan. But I think they, the dad gets them on the weekends. I don't think it's like as much as Mommy Tang has them. So yeah, five days a week, for six to eight hours a day, Mommy Tang had the nerve to say they like to eat light at lunch. You don't have 40 hours a week to be feeding your kids light, especially when they're vegan. Because they're at school having PE, recess, using their mind all day. Just a handful of carbohydrates isn't enough. The school lunch would be better. You could go to a food bank and find something more adequate. But yeah, just she's an, unfortunately just an, another vegan mom that's just totally misinformed when it comes to feeding her kids and just sitting there holding hands, sipping coffee, macking down while her kids are at school having hardly anything to eat. Sorry, but I'm going to leave the video there though. But um, yeah, just vegan moms, please do better.